Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having an amazing day. As you could tell, my background looks pretty strange in this video and that's because I'm actually in my bathtub. Now you may be wondering, why am I in my bathtub? But as you can see by the title of this video, I am actually going to be bonding with my hamster. I don't have a pen that would be safe for a hamster, so the bathtub is the next best option. So I'm just going to show you guys some footage of me and her bonding. I haven't been able to pick her up by the hands yet. She just wants to eat them, which I have washed them with water. So there's no way they smell like food, but she did come from a home with small children. So I wonder if they dropped her or she just doesn't like being picked up. But we're just going to go ahead and have a little bonding session with her and show you guys some great footage of her. So I'm in the bathtub and I just laid down some fleece along the whole bottom of the bathtub so she has some nice grip. Right now she is just in her carrier and we're gonna go ahead and let her out. She is my first hamster and I don't know much about her. I know she's a dwarf hamster, but if you know what specific breed she is, please just comment that down below. Oh, she's climbing on my legs. Hi there, Oreo. Oh, please don't eat my jeans. Oh yeah, she didn't eat my jeans. Okay, and there she is. for a little while. I love that stripe on her back. Well. Looks so cute when she walks away. <laughs> I don't know why, I just think she's so cute. I love the white feet. Are you pretty? She's like pretty cute. Now, where's my treats? Where are you going? <laughs> oh, is she gonna cry again? Oh, maybe I'll lean back again. Oh, she's coming, she's coming. Touch my skin. Oh, she figured out how to get in. You know. 
Oh my gosh, she walks away. I love that. <laughs> my beans are so ticklish. So I've only spent about 15 minutes with her and now she's kind of, well, she just went underneath the fleece and she's trying to escape. So we're just going to go take her back down to her cage. And every time like she goes on my skin, like she tried to bite my foot, she tried to bite my hands. She actually just tried to bite my face. If you guys know why she just seems to be super against like human skin, let me know down in the comments. She's perfectly fine climbing on me, and then once she smells my skin, like my arm, foot, whatever, she like tries to nibble it, and it hurts. So if you guys know why, please just comment that down below. And if you like this video, make sure you give us a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I actually won't be posting this Saturday because it is the 4th of July, but stay tuned till Monday, and I'll see you guys then. And remember to live life to the fullest.